everybody this is nanduram and we are from sonu academy today we are going to explain about environmental studies class 3 cbsc syllabus topic name is the plant fairy in this lesson we are learning about different types of plants let us start our discussion the girl whose name is didi she is talking about her weekend field trip to his brothers and sisters she said last sunday we went to a garden in the neighborhood we played hide and seek and antakshari we had a lot of fun after some time didi said again to his brothers and sisters let us play a new game today we had played this game in the campus last year i will become a plant fairy the plant fairy will call out a name of something and you all will have to touch it the game began didi said the plant fairy asked you to touch a plant at once all the children ran towards the plant amu held the marigold plant shabana sat touching a jasmine plant michael touched a mehandi bush dayaram held a neem tree and stood there didi said now every very good everyone has touched a plant but have you noticed that all plants are different from each other didi you are also sitting on little plants said by shabanam didi said observe the plants and let me tell the differences then the children start noticed that some plants are very big some plants are small and some plants are climbing and some plants are creeping on the ground didi said now see there are different types of plants that are creepers climbers herbs shrubs trees let us start the discussion about these four types of plants creepers creepers grow above the ground they have very weak stem they produce heavy weight of fruit for that creepers cannot the stem becomes very weak and the creepers have unable to stand or climb to grow up examples tomato and watermelon climbers climbers are also have weak stem but they give support to climb up examples grape and money plant herbs herbs are also leafy green plants these plants are useful for food medicines flavoring and perfumes they produce flowers herbs are includes in roots flowers leaves and seeds examples of these plants are spinach coriander mint grass meat etc shrubs so shrubs are small woody plants these plants have soft stem body they are smaller than trees they grow just above the ground shrubs have weak stems they cannot grow much more height like trees these plants are eggs and jasmine let us see about the tree tree is a tall plant with trunk and branches made up of wood trees live for a long time trees are useful for shelter and food they have thick and long trunk example mango and neem tree the children ran again to touch the trees with thick or thin trunks they have seen a tree with it thick has thin has at the one shown in the picture then they noticed that all plants are not having equal stems they have different types of stems that are some are strong some are thick and some are thin the game started again the plant fairy now said touch a tree which has either a thick or a thin children start touching the stems and they came to know that stems give shape and support to the plant stems stem uh, transport water from root to all parts of the plant body it also transport food from leaf to all parts of the plant body stems have branches and leaves some stems are thick and some are thin michael found the game was very interesting he thought how lucky the fairy was she could order everyone around now i want to be the plant fairy said michael the children laughed aloud ho oh, a boy fairy they were now ready to take orders from the new plant fairy so michael said let me some leaves let me get some leaves quickly but remember you are not to pluck the leaves from the plant didi said the children ran to collect the leaves which are laying on the ground 
now the children noticed that do all the chil- uh, leaves are not having same similar color shapes and margin dayaram said i did not know that there were so many types of leaves look some are around us some are long and some are small and some are triangle amma observed that there are so many different colors as well some leaves are light green in color some are dark green in color and some are even yellow red and purple there is one which green but they has white patches on it look at the margins of these leaves these are different from each other some have straight margins and some are uneven and some of these margins are even look like a saw these words are said by shyabanam and again shyabanam observed that leaves are called power house of the plant they prepare food for the plant body they take carbon dioxide inside and releases oxygen outside they need water chlorophyll and carbon dioxide in the presence of sunlight to prepare food this process is called as photosynthesis some leaves are green in color because the presence of chlorophyll and the chlorophyll it is a color pigment even some leaves are yellow and because the presence of carotenoid it is a type of color pigment ammo and shebanam shouted together loudly we also want to be the plant fairy didi said not today maybe the next sunday it is time to go home now thank you